Time now for the Coffee Black Show. What's up, everybody? What's up? How's it going? Welcome to the Coffee Black Show. Yes, it is Friday Night Live. How is everybody doing? Is everybody doing all right? Is everybody doing okay? This is your host, R-E-G-G-I-E, and I be on this M-I-C. Now, man, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta tell y'all some info, okay? A little, well, a little bit of update on what's going on with me, okay? Um... I had a doctor's appointment last week. Yeah, day before Halloween, October 30th, went to the doctor. And got some bad news. Yeah, some really upsetting news, really bad news. Um, One, I have high blood pressure. That seems to run in my race. That's right. Um, African American, black American, whatever you want to call us. Americans with that dark brown skin. We seem to have. We seem to have higher numbers of high blood pressure than other races. That's it. That's in this country. All right. Number two. I have. Diabetes. Another, you know, something that that is high amongst the race. Um, let's see, high blood pressure, diabetes, high cholesterol. Another one that seems to run, that seems to be kind of high amongst black folks in America. Well, dang, I am black, ain't I? So, you know. (laughs) Also, I got those three pieces of health information. Kind of bothered me a little bit. You know, I can handle that. But I have a heart murmur. Yeah, that one's really, really concerning. So, I'm like, oh, man, I done been hit with the whammy. And... If y'all don't know what the whammy is, look up game shows from back in the day. Yeah, that used to be the games, man. Pressure Luck, I think it was. I think that's the name of it. That was that was the yeah. Used to lo- used to love that game show. Whammy, <laughs> but um, yeah. So that kind of bothered me a little, and and you know I've been down in in the dumps, depressed a little bit. But um, thank God for family members and and friends. You know, um, one friend in particular, um, he's like a brother to me, y'all. And that is Sincere B. And if you get a chance, go check him out here on YouTube. Go check out his podcast on Anchor, and check him out on Instagram and Twitter. All under the handle Sincere B. That's C I N C E R E B. Check him out. He's like a brother to me. Show him some love. Say, what's up? <laughs> but yeah, man. So, um, yeah, I had a little problem with that. So I had to go get a blood pressure monitor, a glucose monitor, you know. Because I got to get my health in order. You know, been working on my finances, getting that in order. Now it's time for me to get the health in order. Been working on my spirituality, getting that in order. And I got to get everything in order. So, yeah, you know, got to get the house in order. Ah, uh, So, um. 
you know, been working on that stuff, man. Oh, let me set that down there. Also, man, um, one thing I got to change, well, I got to change my diet, you know, got to change my diet. I thought I was drinking enough water, but I got, uh, apparently I'm not. So I got to drink more water. And that's why, folks, I tell you to hydrate. Stay hydrated. Drinking plenty of water is very, very important. So, got to get that in order. Um, Wow. That means I can't do, like, my YouTube videos of different drinks and snack foods I gotta cut back I gotta matter of fact I'm stopping cold turkey until I get my health back you know in order once I get my health in order oh it's on y'all it is on I will be doing more drink reviews matter of fact I think what I'm gonna do is do um <clears throat> excuse me reviews on on drink alternatives like maybe sparkling water because i love me some sparkling water and then with the high blood pressure thing um i'm finding out that uh, that there are some sparkling waters out there that's high in sodium and i'm finding the ones that have really good flavor are the ones that are high in sodium so yeah i'm gonna be uh <clears throat> doing those reviews excuse me doing those reviews um also maybe bottled water because all bottled water tastes a little different and you know what i want i, I need to get i need to get like a brita water filter so i can stop buying all these bottles of water i don't want to leave a a big footprint on this planet you know i'm trying to i want to not only do i want to be around to see my grandkids I want to be around. I want the. I want the. I want it to be a planet for them to enjoy, you know. Also, so um, all these plastic bottles of water, you know. Hey, we need to recycle or something. I mean, we need to stop being so selfish, man. If you look at it, we just care about us in the here and now. In the right, the right now. That's what it seems like. That's what it seems like we only care about. The right now. We need to um, think about the future. And that's with everything, man. Morally, spiritually, all of it, man. We need to, we need to stop thinking about, oh, you know, and start thinking about the future. And like I said, man, I want to be around to see my grandkids, to to enjoy my grandkids. Not not just to see them, but to enjoy them, to have them enjoy me, to have, um, to be able to to spend some time with them and teach them things, and also learn some things. Because, like I said, I never got a chance to meet my grandparents. And I used to, growing up, man, I used to see kids in school and, you know, spend the weekend with their grandparents and stuff, man. And I never got a chance to. You know, so, yeah. I want to I wanna break that, that mold. Because, from what I understand, my mom didn't get to meet her grandparents and my father didn't get to meet his grandparents. You know, so we got, I want to break that. I want to break that, that chain. And the only way to do that is to, um, you know, um, get healthy. Keep praying and keep living, you know, so yeah, man, got to do that. Got to do that. (laughs) 
You're listening to Coffee Black Radio. Hey, folks, you want to drop by and say hey or be a part of the show? Hit me up with a text message at 912-307-9937. Or you can hit me up by email. And that is R-E-G-I-N-A-L-D-M-967 at gmail.com. Hit me up. Uh, yeah, people, that's the end of the show. I want to say thank you for stopping by and listening. I appreciate it. Until next time, love, peace, and chicken grease. This is R-E-G-G-I-E on this M-I-C, and I am out.